welcome to yet another guide. Uh, this is for the Tumeru Ithil dungeon, the, uh, the Tumerian descendant. Uh, I'm going to tell you right off the bat that this is a sloppy, sloppy win for me. So, so why, if I'm not very good at this, am I doing a guide for it? Because I'm not very good at it. That's exactly why. Because I'm sure there's a lot of people out there, you know, who, even looking at guides, cannot do this. I looked at guides, I couldn't do what other people were doing, the dodges that they could do. I even tried the cheese strat, where you just, you know, try to hit them through one of these statues. You get them kind of stuck between the statue and the column, and you just kill them like that. I couldn't do it. The problem is, you would often, you know, come around and, you know, kill me then, and if that wasn't the problem, if I could dodge him and get back around and get him stuck again, he can do his damn boomerang attack, straight through that thing, unlike you, you can't attack through the columns, but he can. And, you know, when he gets into stage two, that will kill you immediately. That's a one-hit kill if he gets you in. And, you know, you say, well, why can't you dodge the, the boomerang attack? Because you can't see it. It comes through that, and by the time, you know, he's starting it, it's gonna hit you in the face before you know it's even coming. All right, so here's the basic strat for this. It's real simple. Um, you just want to dodge right past all of his first attacks. If he does hit you with one attack, just calmly just wait for it and time it right. You can get a dodge in uh, back again to his right after his first attack. And that's for his first stage. It's real easy to do that. You can always get an attack in, either right after the first dodge or after you get hit and then you dodge. You can always get a hit in. Now, a lot of people, you know, say, you know, you should just go for uh, viscerals here, you know, straight from the start, but I am terrible at it. I'm going to be the first to tell you, I'm awful at it. And so I would often waste all of my bullets, you know, just getting them down uh, to half, and then by the time he got to uh, his second stage, I'm out of bullets, I can't do any more viscerals, and, you know, what else do I have? The cheese strats, it didn't work for me, like I said. So I'd save all of my bullets until the last half, and then just shoot as much as possible, basically. Um, you want to try to get some viscerals in. I'm awful at it. Uh, if he does do his annoying, annoying boomerang attack, uh, then if your shot hits him quickly enough, then that will cancel it out. Uh, you will either stop the attack from hitting you in the first place, or if it's already hit you, it will stop the boomerangs from boomeranging back towards you. Uh, they'll just respawn in his hands and you won't get hit. So that does help quite a bit. And at this point, I'm trying desperately to get viscerals, but I'm awful at it. But I, I think that uh, you should go ahead and try to get as many viscerals in as you can in this second stage. Do not do it on the first stage. The first stage is the easy part. Uh, you can see here I've only got three shots left. I've only gotten one visceral in. I mean, it does do a good bit of damage. It does the equivalent of two fully charged R2s. Um, but it's not super helpful only getting one in, so I, I hope you can get a few more in than that. And then the other part of the strategy is that, you know, as a last-ditch effort, after you run out, if you have not killed them by the time you run out of bullets, uh, use the lead. Drink some lead. You'll see me switching to it pretty soon here. You, you do want to find a good time to do it. And here I go switching to it. I should have had it a little better. There's the lead elixir. And at this point, uh, he can't stun you. You can drink whenever you want uh, your blood vials. Uh, you can get any charged R2s on them that you want. You can basically just pound away. Um, you can still dodge. You cannot run at this point, so don't try that. Either dodge or just, you know, pound the crap out of them and drink vials when you can. Uh, it does get a little close here, but finally, I did kill this guy. Now, if only I could find a strat for the next guy. That damn headless bloodletting beast.
Jeez, Jesus. All right. Off to the last two guys. Good luck. <laughs> 